This video is sponsored by Surfshark. What is happening guys? We are Craig and Amy and you are watching King It! And at the moment we are travelling around our stunning home country of Wales in our bus called Custard. Last week saw us off to a flying start, diving in waterfalls, hanging out with our other van life pals and taking in some stunning Welsh scenery. We are also travelling with our friends Tanya and Adam from Jits into the Sunset. And they're slowly learning that things don't always run smoothly when they're with King in it. Last week we had an explosion in the van and Amy dropped everyone's dinner on the floor. Love you! In this week's video you will see us go on the search for a special animal. Clue number one. The new wig for you. Walk a donkey. <laughs> Just walking a donkey in Wales. <laughs> Cuddle a sheep. Oh my goodness me. So strap yourselves in for a van life adventure in Wales. Starting the week off right with a Mexican night in Jets. So we had this idea, we were like, we'll get a bottle of tequila, you guys cook the food. So we've got tequila, Cointro, limes, and some ice in the freezer for margaritas. <laughs> <laughs> we might be posh, we might take our Nutripilla and do frozen margaritas, like proper van life wankers. Yeah, I think it would be great. They're so good as well. Craig makes the best margaritas. Um, and if you didn't see our story from a few weeks back when you made us some, um, we just smashed the whole place up, didn't we? Ayo DJ, drop that beat. Oh my God, she literally smashed her glass. Smash my mum's Margie glasses. We, we smashed up the attic because we were that drunk, we were twerking and everything was smashed. <laughs> Hopefully tonight we have a repeat of that. No, no. We're going we're going in jits, so we need to be on our best behaviour. You can't be lobbing stuff around their van. You listening? Me? <laughs> Uh, wrong entrance, actually, guys. It's the wrong entrance. <laughs> wrong entrance. Oh, okay. It's okay. <laughs> like a back door, Chris. Oh, wow. It smells amazing. Let me take the drink off you. <gasps> yes, please. <laughs> yes, lad. <laughs> <laughs> so, so this is good. the spread, Tanya's making the food, we've got the playlist on and this um, this apparently has become Craig's seat. Don't Craig's touch my seat. Craig's jitter's thrown. He's the, it's, it's the only one he'll sit on when he's in jets. <laughs> but this is wonderful, lovely and cosy. No, they look cute but I have no idea what that is. Okay, estos son tamarindos. What? Tamarindos, tamarinds. So tamarindos. You, you crack this open. Right. Leaves go on a tree. What's it taste like? Try it, it's really nice. And the seeds, like yeah. the stones inside them are so really smooth and quite satisfying. But mm -hmm. just remember there's a stone that you're not supposed to eat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're really sweet. It's sweet, yeah. I Do you like it? Like it? Last I like week it. we tasted like the dish <laughs> for the first time and this week it's a tamarindo. I'm getting so much culture in my own country <laughs> of another country. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll tell you what I thought it was. I thought it was a kiwi on a diet. <laughs> <laughs> a tiny weird shaped kiwi. <laughs> yeah. Salud. 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 Oh my god, that's <laughs> so good. The problem is though, I could absolutely hammer this. If it wasn't for the salt putting me off the beginning. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd just steer them away. Get the salt in with it, it's so good. Give me a demo, give me a demo. So look, here, you just open, close. You'll see okay. that, I mean, I don't know if you want to. Open, close, and in. then you push down, you see? So the next section is, um, to be paid for. So uh, if you are a uh, OnlyFans subscriber, uh, the link is in the description. <laughs> the guy said though, and we say it back to them, like if you don't use our toilet, we'll be offended. So I'm gonna use the guy's toilet for the first time. Great success. Tanya, yeah? how'd I get out? Hey. Hello, <laughs> welcome back. Thank to you. How was, was your Jits, Jits toilet experience? It was wonderful, thank you so much. Let's play some dominoes, lads. <laughs> Let's play some f***ing dominoes. 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 <laughs> Where's that bottle of tequila gone? <laughs> oh yeah, it's I gone. Smash it! Smash it! Before we 
carry on with this video, we'd like to take a minute to thank this week's sponsor, Surfshark. Surfshark is an award-winning, secure VPN. This is Jerry, aka Surfshark, who's basically an online bodyguard that encrypts your online data to help you stay private and protected every day. Do you ever worry about your safety online? No. Well, you should. Your security and data is at risk 24-7, especially if you're not aware. Installing Surfshark's VPN will probably be the best move you make this year. It protects you when you're using public Wi-Fi by encrypting your data, making it useless for people who steal it. If you don't have Surfshark, hackers and viruses are more likely to access your computer and steal your personal information. Julia here does not have Surfshark, and now she's broke. Daddy! If you get Surfshark after you've been robbed, at least you can unlock up to 15 of Netflix's largest libraries to find a sad film and cry about it. Just go to surfshark.deals forward slash R-Y-O-W for 83% off and three months for free. Don't be a muppet like Julia. <laughs> Good job! No! Uh, no more! Morning, coach. Morning. Morning, lads. You ready for the playoffs today? <laughs> You're like a safari coach. Like if there was an a, a antelope team of footballers, you would be the coach. <laughs> well, I thought we'd do a little bit of exploring today. We're going to find something very special. I've only got my fingers and toes crossed that we find them, but I thought um, safari tour guide kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah? Love it. Who plays football on the weekends? Who plays football on the weekends, Captain Peters? Hey! You wouldn't be able to tell that we were up last night getting smashed. We drank the whole bottle of tequila. The whole it's gone, mate. <gasps> gone. I came home at nine minutes past one, um, got a taxi from just there, uh, <laughs> and Craig said you rocked up about two, was it? About two o'clock, yeah. O'clock in the morning. Who do we think we are? We're like 30 plus, Craig. I know. Sunshine! Woo! It actually came out as soon as you said that. <laughs> I am God, I will be here all week. <laughs> We're going to find something special. It's going to be great. See the size of that Not for me. <laughs> I found some evidence of possible life. <gasps> Clue number one. It's a new wig for you. What could it be? That's a little toupee. It's Trump here. <laughs> <laughs> Who is Donald? So the weather's taken a turn. We're yet to find the secret animal. But we're not quitters, are we, Craig? No, we found their pubes and we'll find the rest of them. <laughs> Clue number two. After around 40 minutes of searching, we finally spotted them. It's the Highland Cool! <laughs> yes, are they lost, Craig? I think so. <laughs> Wrong postcode. Should we speak in a Scottish accent so they know what we're saying? Yeah. Hello, Lassie! <laughs> what kind of new? I'm so happy, I'm so chuffed he found them, Craig. In Wales! How oh, good gone? It was such a reward after all the walking through the forest and up and over a mountain to see these hairy monsters. Some of them were super chilled, but others liked a bit of headbanging. What a find! Who would have thunk we'd find Highland cows in Wales? I know! <laughs> I do wonder what accent they have got though, and if they were here from birth or... What's happening, Beth? What's happening, Bertie Bar? How are you? <laughs> so, when we were woken up here, we saw a sign that said that the cows are here to help with the bracken, which is kind of just like the... 
overgrowth. Yeah, of the plants and things. So, so they've just, just they've just got a big buffet on the hill, basically. Yeah, they just clean up the place, keep it tidy. But it's unbelievable because we're parked in a lay-by. Just look at look and you come to the top. There's like a path you walk up, and then this is where you end up. It's unbelievable. Absolutely. The views are outrageous. So um, yeah, if anyone's interested, we'll pin where this is in the description walk. and do the walk. Yeah. Bloody brilliant, mate. Oh what a find. We didn't even know about this, we just stumbled upon it. What do you think of that then, lads? Woo! Absolutely great! Absolutely amazing. Hang on. Oh, oh. <laughs> the ground's not right! <laughs> <laughs> so, um, we may or may not have a little surprise for Tanya and Adam later. It's, good. it's a good one. And it's I'm a great so one. excited. I, I so have excited. absolutely no idea what it is. I just know no it's idea. not food. It's not food. No. It's not food. It's not food. Is it's it? Not food. Is it? Is it a little? Is it animal related? Don't, no more questions. Don't guess it because it no will more be questions. a shame. <laughs> home sweet home, babes. He's right. How long did that take, Craig? We were out for like three, three hours. I think so. Yeah. What's for din din's Then I'm starving. Everyone is Hank Marvin, aka hungry. Uh, so we've got uh, <laughs> Richmond sausages. We're gonna have beans, we maybe have some fried bread. Whatever's in the fridge, really, because we need to do another shop today. Everything's sort of running out. Full vegan fry up, is it? Yeah. Get in. Next stop, we're gonna walk a donkey. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> We were off to see our friend Julia from Good Day Out, who was about to introduce us to her big hairy pets. I literally dinky donkeys, look at these. What do you mean? Oh, they're spiny! <laughs> we can 100% get one in donkeys our best place. <gasps> look at you! Oh my goodness, <laughs> didn't know that they were dinky. <laughs> they're tiny. This is this the best day of your life? I don't know who to touch first. <laughs> oh, yeah, look, a little bit of a wobble. You're having the best day of your life, mate. This is the best day of my life. Oh, you want a hug? Oh, you want a kiss? <laughs> With tongue. Oh, my <laughs> Calm down, son. <laughs> look at this guy. <laughs> look at the cuddle station, Craig. <laughs> oh, you're the best boy. That's so cute. <laughs> So Julius just told us that the donkeys could live until mid fifties. <laughs> That's crazy. That is really cool. Kisses. <laughs> look at his little ears going up. You look lovely. Mm. <laughs> there you go, lads. All geared up with their little miniature backpacks. Let's go. Come on, Mama. These little munchkins get a walk around the block on the reg to keep their joints loose. They love it and they look so blooming cute with their little backpacks. I just want one for Christmas. Well, it's my birthday this month, see? So. <laughs> Come on, look, it's stingy nettle. Come on. <laughs> Hello, boy. You tell him, Abe, go on. Well done, Abe. <laughs> Just walking a donkey in Wales. <laughs> oh. Once we let them off the leads, they were loving the freedom and kicking about in the field like free little lambs. So uh, it's time to uh, attempt to catch them. <laughs> so they've been running around like mad heads. Now we're going to try and get him back on the leads to go back. I can, so I did, I'm funny. looking at him, he's just going, I see not. <laughs> <laughs> so this is Maverick. He is four years old. It's his birthday in two weeks. <laughs> my birthday in three weeks. So we are both Geminis. Um, very strong headed and just real cute, you know. <laughs> Donkey Walkover is amazing. <laughs> yeah. So good. And we've got one more animal related stop today. We're going to go and see our mate Elle. So this is a surprise for Tanya and Adam. They both really want to do this and they don't know what it is yet. They're trying to guess, but I'm like, no more questions. No more questions. So, <laughs> to the next surprise. I got um, mud on my, I didn't bring any wellies up, I just got my mums and they're gross. Oh, I should probably change some shoes. Yeah, you probably should. <laughs> This is Ellie. She makes incredible cakes. You might remember the ones that she made us when we were building out our bus. 
We're just joking, guys. <laughs> They're just forming a bottle. I'll keep up in the camera. Oh no! <laughs> oh, There's Stacey oh, behind. Stacey. Is that Stacey? Is that the mum? Is that the mum? Gavin and Stacey. She looks so extra. So this is Tanya and Adam's surprise. Oh my goodness me! <laughs> Baby Neil! Neil, he's the best. He's called Neil. He's new to our friend Elle's family. He was rejected, bless him, and they've taken him in. Oh. And he's ready for a bottle feed. Bless him, Elle, haven't you, mate? Yes. Yay! Oh my god. What you want to do is hold the bottle <laughs> and then just tip your head back. Come on. And then just keep it up as much as you can. Oh my god. Oh, Dad. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> Do you love your surprise? This is the best surprise ever. <laughs> oh, oh, you're so sweet. <laughs> oh my goodness me. <laughs> Hello baby Neil. So cute. He's amazing. So chill. He's like in a milk coma now. Yeah, he's, he's had a nap. Oh, bless him. <laughs> Ellie's mum, Sean, owns this beautiful B&B in the Brecon Beacons. We'll leave the link below if you fancy staying. You'll be surrounded by animals with the sound of the river. Pure bliss. All right, we didn't plan on this day being so massive on a hangover. <laughs> We've done so much. So everybody is now starving, hungry and dehydrated. So we're like, tease as much food as possible. And then we're just going to have an early night, I think. But everything in the fridge is out of date, so we're just hoping for the best. <laughs> for Adam's face. <laughs> yeah, that's news uh, to you, mate. <laughs> Good, so we're just risking it, are we? Yeah, yeah roll the dice. Roll <laughs> the dice. Roll the dice. So we've got like a little Mexican thing here going on. It's Mexican night again. Oh, there's pasta. It's a fusion. Keith's yeah. putting in a shift. It's basically everything we've got left in the cupboards. I think tomorrow we're going to have to do a shop. Yeah, I think but so. But yeah, I mean, we are so tired tonight, so we'll see you in the morning. Morning, lads. So we're up bright and early. The rain's actually stopped, so we're going to go for a run. We're going to attempt to get to the top of Penavan. Which but is the highest mountain in the south of Wales? Yeah, easy. No problem. See how it goes, shall we? Get up there in a few minutes, I reckon. Back in time for coffee. Here's the local poo, look. <laughs> See you in my lap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright lads. We didn't walk in, that's weird. We've been running the whole way and then you press the cord and start walking. We've definitely ran the whole yeah. way. Now I forgot how steep it is, so we basically it's like a power hike and then when it's flat, we're like, oh we'll run by here so we look hard. <laughs> but as you can see. Like most of mine and Adam's runs, it's, you, you can't it's see anything. Well, well. What are you going to do now then? Going in. to run with a swim in the waterfall. <laughs> Why not? It's all good though, isn't it? Yeah, Craig was like, we gotta do it. I was like, yeah, we should. Then I got down here, I was like, no, we shouldn't. He was like, is this a bad idea? And we're like, no, come on, let's just do it. And then now we feel absolutely great. It's, it's so always good. the way with cold water swimming, isn't it? You always question yourself. Yeah, yeah. But then when you're in, it's like, yes, so happy with myself. It's so good. It's just so euphoric. Good. Yeah. So if you're watching this, get out with some cold water. You won't regret it. Nice of me. Yeah, mate. Just for making me do it. Don't worry, man. Also, we're in our pants. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we're both just saying, like, it's hard to get yourself, like, in the moment sometimes. And, like, we're always, like, talking about other things we've done. 
And so I was like, babe, we need a cold water dip. And then we, I saw the waterfall, I was like, we've got to go in. And as soon as you do it, it just brings you back to where you are. You can't be anywhere else, can you? Yeah, that is it. It's really, it's really grounding and meditative. Yeah, sure. And I'm now running. I feel like so good. Yeah. A run, a run and a dip in the water. Uh, we were up and down in an hour as well. Yeah, the whole thing was an hour and it's supposed to take between two and three hours. We went to the top of the mountain. Yay! Do it! Do it! Just do, do it. it! Morning lads, quick dip and a run. And now we gotta do some van life chores. I won't lie, I had a jam donut for breakfast. Um, while Craig ran up a mountain. <laughs> I need to get out more, I need to get into it. I need to get into, you know, the outdoors and loving, moving my body and everything, which I do when we get to do it. Do you know what you need? What I need. You need some cold water therapy. Yeah, I do. Fancy a swim? I do fancy, you. I do fancy Go on, a babes. swim. I do. All right. I know a great spot. Well, actually, Amy found it, but. <laughs> but first, we need to do our van life duties, don't we? Yeah, we need some water and we need to empty our grey tank and we need to empty our toilet. Burn! Uh, we're just waiting for Tanya because she's just filming a bug in her window. She's been doing it for about 20 minutes. <laughs> it's usually us that we're waiting for, so no qualms, guys. You take your time. You take your time, lads. All right, we found a lovely little campsite. Got a dodgy setup because I uh, got the wrong kit, but. Mm. Oh, that is a, a great representation of King in it. It's like. <laughs> just sort of. Botched together. It works, but there's a few gaps, you know? <laughs> to fill up water. Custer's thirsty. Look who we found at the campsite. I love finding dogs, Craig. <laughs> so, I've been doing a lot of wild camping in Wales. There are quite a few spots on park for night, but the campsites are really nice around here. In the Bracken Beacons, everyone's been really friendly and they've let us use um, their facilities for a couple of quid. In the drive. Oh, look what you've got on there. Sure. I thought you were going to go, oh my God, you smell so bad. And I know I did. Oh, yeah, I had like a little flannel washed this morning. Uh, but yeah, I've put some new clothes on. Show us your merchandise. I've got me king in it jumper on. Oh, can people buy that? Would it take me through the day? Yes, you can. You can, you can actually get one of these yourself on the King in It website, www.kingin-it.com. Should we do a flash sale? Forward slash shop, yes. How much? Let's do a sale. 10% off? 10% off. If you use the code Amy Looks Sick. There we go. <laughs> 24 hours only. <laughs> All right, just before I do this, I just want to say, can we just take a moment to appreciate Danny Simpson art. She made us this incredible drawing of Wales and she even put a little Welsh love spoon with king in it on it as well. So flipping good. We love it, it's brilliant. But I want to get a proper frame for it because it's literally just the, the paper stuck to the wall. Yeah. But our mate John made us this crown to go above my head when I drive. Mm -hmm. So we're going to put this on the bathroom door, Danny, so don't don't despair if you're watching this. Don't think well, Don't we're worry. downgrading you. Um, so we're going to move the map and we're going to put the crown up. So it looks like you're driving with so the crown. So it looks like so I'm look like like a king when I'm driving. So 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 not wonky would be great, and uh, <laughs> don't break anything while you're doing it. Yeah. I was thinking a bit of an angle. No, don't be silly. Is there wires behind there? Hopefully not. And the grand reveal. <gasps> Ta-da! King in it, baby. Yeah, it looks so good. How good is that? <laughs> Although if people don't know who I am, they'd be like, who does that guy think he is? If anybody thinks about nicking my little plastic thing by ear. You what? My little plastic thing. Oh yeah. Oosh! One of them. <laughs> Let's go get some ice cream. Welsh town and um, as soon as we came in we were like Kess is not going to fit here but we've managed to find a spot for her just on the street she fits in lovely <laughs> massive who owns that? not me <laughs> this is the reason why if we were ever going to do another van build we'd get a smaller van 
just just so you can fit in a normal car park, Craig. Do you know what I mean? But I mean, it's, it's pros and cons, isn't it? Yeah. We could do cartwheels in Casted, so yeah. it's worth it. It is worth it. It looks like the heavens are going to open now. It does have this And for a rushing. Oh, oh baby. Oh. Jackpot. I don't even care. Vegan Ferrero Rocher ice cream, and underneath I got Biscoff. Oh, never. Levels! Oh, watch yourself. Slap them. <laughs> Good call. We waited for the rain to pass. It passed for about two minutes, and now it's raining again. Brilliant. But we're going up anyway. We're going because life is for living and that's what we're going to do right now. Lucky you got your brolly and your little summer hat then, babes. Right, <laughs> it is May after all. Yeah. And if I did mention it, it's my birthday soon. Remember before when you said, oh, we can't hang around with Tanya and Adam because they always hike and we can't have friends like that. Yeah, I did, yeah. Now look at us, hiking. <laughs> look at that. Hiking in the rain. Sheep. Sheep. River. <laughs> on their vlog say how long it takes to get here what was that 40 minutes, 40 minutes left, 40 no minutes. Well, half hour half hour 40 half minutes hour. to get to the lake apparently it's one of the top thousand places to come and see you reading that in the world you reading that um on a list compiled by lonely planet is it yeah i mean look at the state of it it's amazing <laughs> It was way too windy and cold at the top, but we found the little pool and we're going to go in for a swim. Second one of the day. Would first... you like some snacks first? <laughs> should, we have, should we have some snacks tea. after? Little digi bees. <laughs> you are a psychopath. Who brings biscuits in a little tub like that? Honestly. This is where we're going in. Still raining, but just great to be out, you know? You ready? Uh, yeah. Come on, man, get your bits off! <laughs> I think my bits might come off in a minute. <laughs> Through your own wall, baby! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>! <laughs> Without meaning to, our channel is slowly turning into like the wild swimming channel. <laughs> but it's so good. Every time we go in, like you just, the anxiety before really builds up because like, oh my God, it's so cold. But then when you get in, it's like such a rush, isn't it? And me and Adam were saying this morning, like it just like brings you back to the moment and uh, makes you feel alive. It's great, isn't it? It's wonderful, yeah. Even though I look like a, a lobster. <laughs> Little walking lobster <laughs> with red legs. She looks like a dad on tour. <laughs> but yeah, back to the vans now. Cup, Cup of tea. tea. Have a biscuit tea. Biscuit, biscuit tea for the lads. Yeah, I, heat is going on. I hope we've got some friendly neighbours as well scratching their bums on our bus. <laughs> I thought you were talking Don't about worry, us. We will. <laughs> <laughs> the fluffy kind. All right, lads, that is it for this week's video. It's been a mad one. We've done so much, haven't we? So much stuff. It's been full on. Loads of animals and adventures. But as always, thank you all so much for watching and supporting. You're a bunch of legends. Yeah, we've just finished um, our sixth podcast of this season. So this week we've talked about um, indigenous tribes and uncontactable people. Which a, is so interesting, one. so interesting. It is. So if you're not subscribed to our podcast already, make sure you do that or you can just download them wherever you get your podcasts. So join us next week for a little bit of this. And a little bit of that. Whoa, my goodness. And maybe a little bit of this. Yeah, exactly. Well, Yay! Yay! <laughs>
And remember, if you want to get yourself some King in It merch, use the code AMYLOOKSICK to get 10% off. Also, just to mention, May is Mental Health Awareness Month, so we hope you're all taking care of your mental health, getting out in nature, being kind to your body, eating some great food. Just taking time off work if that's what you feel like you need to, just grounding yourself and getting back to a good mental state, you know? Yeah. Yeah. And what should they do, babes? And you should always, always take control of your life. It's your life. Do what you want to do with it. Make sure you're ruling your own world. One, two, three, bye! bye.